morning welcome back to the video i hope you guys are doing extremely well so friends in this video i will discuss most important and frequently asked mcqs of unit number one which is electromagnetic theory of subject code phy110 engineering physics okay so without wasting any time let's proceed with the first question but before proceeding please do subscribe the channel and share these all these videos in every group okay i will upload 60 mcqs of uh, each 20 mcqs from each is three units okay so do not miss any one of the question all the questions are important so first question is which of the following is a scalar field in electromagnetic theory option number a electric field option number b is magnetic field and option number c electric potential and last option is magnetic potential and the correct option of this question is option number c which is electric potential next question what does the gradient of a scalar field represent is it the magnitude of the uh, field or the rate of change and direction of maximum increases and the c option is the rate of changes direction of maximum decreases and the last option is the curl of the field and the correct option of this question is option number b which is the rate of change and direction of maximum increases third number question divergence measures what rate of change of a vector field option number b is circul uh, circulation of a vector field and option number c is spreading or convergence of a vector field and last option is curl of a vector field and the correct option is option number c which is spreading or convergence of a vector field fourth number question what is the physical significance of gauss theorem in electromagnetic theory option number a it relates electric field and magnetic field option number b it relates divergence of electric field to enclosed charge option number c is it describes the relationship between electric and magnetic potentials and last option is it defines the magnetic flux through a closed surface and the b option is the correct option which is the re it relates divergence of electric field to enclosed charge next question a Stokes theorem relates a line integral to a option number A surface integral, option number B volume integral, option number C is point change and last option is divergence and the correct option is option number A which is surface integral. Next question which equation represents the La uh, Laplace sorry Laplace equation in electromagnetism and the option number A is del dot E is equal to rho by e epsilon naught option number b is del dot b is equal to 0 and c option is del square e is equal to 0 and last option is del square b is equal to mu naught j and the correct option is option number c which is del square e is equal to 0 let's proceed with the seventh number question all these all these 60 questions are important do not miss any one of the question Seventh number question, the continuity equation describe the conversion of option number A, electric charge, option number B, magnetic field lines, option number C is electric potential and last option is magnetic flux and the correct option is option number A which is electric charge. Next question, which of the Maxwell equation describe how electric fields are generated by changing magnetic fields, option number A. E, Gauss law of electricity, option number B, Gauss law of magnetism, option number C is Faraday's law of electromagnetic induction and last option is Ampere circuital law and the correct option is option number, oh, sorry, option number C is the correct option which is Faraday's law of electromagnetic induction. Next question, what does Ampere circuital law relates to in electromagnetism? Option number A electric field to magnetic field option number b magnetic field to electric field option number c is electric current to magnetic field and last option is electric charge to electric field and the correct option is option number b which is magnetic field to electric field next question the maxwell displacement current was introduced to what option number a explain the propagation of electromagnetic waves option number b is correct a uh, disk sorry correct a uh, discrepancy in ampere circuital law option number c is describe the behavior of capacitors and last option is quantify the magnetic field inside a solenoid and the correct option is option number b which is correct a uh, discrepancy in ampere circuital law 
let's proceed with the next question the maxwell equation the term del into e is sorry del cross e is associated with option number a magnetic field option number b electric potential option number c is electric current and last option is elect magnetic potential and the correct option is option number a which is magnetic field let's proceed with the next question what is the integral form of faraday's law of electromagnetic induction option number a integral e dot dl is equal to minus d b by dt option number b is integral b dot dl is equal to mu naught l option number c is d to uh, integral b dot dl is equal to mu naught epsilon naught d e by dt and last option is e dot d sorry integral e dot dl is equal to epsilon naught l and the correct option of this question is option number a which is integral e dot dl is equal to minus dv by dt next question which maxwell equation relates the circulation of the electric field to the time rate of change of the magnetic field option number a gauss law of electricity option number b gauss law of magnetism and option number c is faraday's law of electromagnetic induction and last option is ampere circuital law and the correct option of this question is option number c which is faraday's law of electromagnetic induction next question the term epsilon naught in maxwell equation represents what option number a permeability of free space option number b permittivity of free space and option number c is electric charge and last option is magnetic field strength and the correct option of this question is option number b which is permittivity of free space 15th number question what is the physical significance of gauss law of magnetism option number a it describes the behavior of magnets option number b it relates the divergence of the magnetic field to enclosed magnetic charge option number c is it explain the motion of charged particles and the last option is it defines the electric flux through a closed surface and the correct option of this question is option number b which is it relates the divergence of the magnetic field to enclosed magnetic charge next question which maxwell equation is equivalent to the statement that magnetic monopoles do not exist option number a gauss law of electricity option number b gauss law of magnetism option number c is faraday's law of electromagnetic induction and last option is ampere circuital law and the correct option of this question is gauss law of magnetism 17th number question in electromagnetic theory the quantity the quantity j represents what is it electric potential or magnetic flux or is it electric current density and last option is electric charge and the correct option is electric current density 18th number question what is the integral form of gauss law of gauss law of electricity so the integral form is the uh, option number a is the correct which is the uh, integral e dot d is equal to epsilon naught integral rho dv is the correct option of this question and all these the uh, laws are very important do not miss any one of the law go through all this law all of these law if you haven't gone through that okay next question which of the following equations is associated with the generation of electromagnetic waves option number a ampere circuital law option number b gauss law of magnetism option number c faraday's law of electromagnetic induction and last option is maxwell equation in free space and the correct option of this question is option number d which is maxwell equation in free space and the last question is the correction two ampere circuital law involving the displacement current was introduced by whom is it James Clerk Maxwell or Michael Faraday or Andrew Marin Ampere or last option is Henry Hertz and the correct option is option number A which is James Clerk Ma Maxwell is the correct option. Thank you so much for watching the videos if you guys have enjoyed watching the videos please do not forget to hit the like button and share these videos in every group thank you so much bye bye.